Oh, Hank! Hank, you look so happy. Look at that, he's so happy. He's about to get the aggressive bites here pretty quick after being happy and being rubbed. Yes, until we're being happy and rubbed, and oh my god, he's actually on the it's field. It's a bio titan. It is a bio titan. So, today we have the Estromatellum versus the Tan Raven Guard. I didn't want to make using, that sound bad. Using the Death Watch rules today to try them out. Really? Yes. No freaking way. Because I do like the idea of being able to get sustained hits and lethal hits. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, hi. Did he just poop into your lap? Yes. Yeah. Good. Yeah, so while Mason is just um, stroking Hank, oh, he's not happy. Anyway, Tom, we're being happy. It is the mission is very simple. Yet again, five objectives. You basically get a point at the start of turn two. And you see your we command have... phase of turn two, yep. And for each objective that you hold, and. Yeah, we're just keeping it simple. No secondaries because the secondary cards that I got are apparently the ones that GW says are bad. And I gotta return them for a refund. And on that note, Mason, because I have the camera over here, how about you tell the audience what you have? Right, so I have two units of five incursors, each with a haywire mine. I have two Invictor Warsuits. I have two Storm Speeder Thunderstrikes. I have one Phobos Captain, and he is attached to a unit of three Eliminators with just the regular Bolt Sniper Rifles. I did seriously consider swapping them out, but seeing what I was gonna fight today, but I figured, you know what? That would be kind of a dick move. <laughs> to tear, tailor the list. Were you actually expecting me to use my guard today? Yes. Oh. Well, in that case, <laughs> talk about the guard. <laughs> with a tank commander right there and a Lumen Rust with heavy bolters and Laz Cannon and a heavy stop. Got three Chimeras. Ichi, Ni, San. Each one of them has a squad of Canadian shock troops. The special weapons in each one is is a melt gun and a grenade launcher. Yay! Got a lemon rust demolisher with plasma and lads. Got a tech priest, armored sentinel with a multi laser actually, and a Canadian shock troop squad right there. Grenade launcher and melt gun. And time to be quick. First turn. Oh wow, I actually got, got a first turn, so your scout moves first if you have any. I do not have any scouts, but I do have movement. Actually moved things. I moved a lot of things actually. Um, actually everything moved except the squad of Cadians in the building right there. So, everything moved up as you can see. Now, starting off with the Shuni phase, I'm going to do Chimera 501 into the Eliminators right there. I'm shooting everything into them. Sorry. Uh -huh. And what's the high strength weapon you're going to be shooting at him? Ah, uh, strength six. Strength six, you know what? Uh, I'm going to use the captain's ability for once per battle round to have a zero CP stratagem on him to transhuman physiology. I mean, what does that do? You can't wound me on anything less than a four. Fucking piece of shit! I'll kick your ass! Piece of shit! Assholes! Holy shit! Bitch! Hey. This is the... Chimera. These are the laws gonna, right? That's what I'm looking for. And you say there was minus one hit, right? Correct. So we're hitting on fives. When you on fives too. Yeah, one wound. No AP. So three up armor. All good. Well, then what I say? I say heavy bolter to you. One you were hit. saying heavy bolter. One wound. AP minus one. Boop. So, still three up cover because yeah. I'm in cover and it's AP minus one and I'm still good. Oh my goodness. Well, then what I say, I say the communal multi laser at you. What is it, three shots? Four actually. Still? Oh wow, all hex. Um, one move. Fours. Yep. AP? Zero sailing. Before it was minus one, but now it's zero. 
All right, well, still three up. Boop. Dang. And there's still going to be a whole lot more shooting at it, so. Oh, yes. The big way we Ross Demolisher with six supercharged plasma and Demolisher cannon into the Incursors. Which, which activates the combat support ability of the Invictor Warsuit. And one that dies. Once per turn. Okay. In your opponent's shooting phase, when a friendly Adeptus starts Phobos Infantry unit within six is selected as a target of an attack, you can use this. If it does, after the enemy's models has finished making the attacks, mm -hmm. this model can shoot as if it were your shooting phase. But when resolving those attacks, it can only target that enemy unit. And also for a while, scanning shooting at the World Suit 2. So, starting with the Demolisher Cannon. Which weapon is this? This is going to be the Demolisher Cannon, D6 plus 3. Oh, nine shots. yes. And is there a minus one to hit him? Um, you know what? I might just activate smoke. Okay, fine. Getting on fives. Oh, wow, that's a lot of fives. As in three fives. Winning on twos. That many at minus LOL. Four. Lol, so I can't save these. <laughs> so, uh, what's the damage? D6 plus uh, 7,000? Just, uh, just, just out of curiosity. Uh, D6, actually. Oh, so I, if you roll any ones... Dead. Dead. Alright, so it is 2D3 shots. It is not twin-linked. Yes, so on that note... Three shots. Hitting on fives. Ooh, one hit. And what are you on a minus three AP? So I still got a six up. It's possible, just not likely. Boink. Nope, another guy bites the dust. So now this is the last cannon into the war suit there. <laughs> oh, shoot, that failed. Well, in Victor War Suit's turn to shoot back. These are all three shots. First is the heavy bolter. This does have sustained hits one, but I get none of those. So one failure to hit. And strength five. So one wound. AP is minus one, two damage. So you... Uh, I'm good. It has a two-up armor now. All Russes have two-up armor saves now. Ooh. Well then, next up is the Iron Hail Twin Auto Cannon. This is, whoops, twin linked. Three shots hitting on threes. All hits. Strength nine. Uh, something's 11. So I need fives re-rolling. Oh, wow, it's all... Oh, and I did... I... Oath... I did have Oath a moment on him, too. Yes, you did. So I'll actually have to, uh, redo some of those... One of those wound dice from the, uh, Heavy Bolter. Yes. Alright, so... One is so far. AP. Minus one, three damage. I'm gonna do a command point and re-roll that, actually. Alright, so zero CP. And thank goodness that made it. And uh, re-rolling the wound for one of the heavy bolters that hit mm -hmm. because of both moment. Nope. Yeah. No. And the iron hail, the twin iron hail heavy stubber, three is hit, but both of moment. All right. Uh, this is rapid fire three, but I'm not within eighteen. So I need uh, see strength four against toughness twelve. Oh, so I need sixes. Yes. Sixes re-rolling. So, one AP zero. Two up. Ooh, barely. Still, it's a nice thing to have. Yeah, what it were. So, now the Luminous Tank Commander is going to shoot its Battle Cannon and Heavy Bolters into the Incursors, then the last cannon into the War Suit. The cool thing is this, I completely forgot about. Because I'm on an objective, because of Armored Spearhead, I reroll all failed hits. Number of shots for the battle cannon. G6 plus 3. Oh my good. What is with me rolling nines? I'm so happy. All of a sudden you roll all ones to hit. No! That was a lot of ones, but I do have all rerolls. Um, I did move sadly, so. Yeah, okay. Um, what do you want twos? So that's everything except one. AP. It's going to be minus. That's a good question. If my phone is going to do anything. It to doesn't you. matter. You sure about that? I rolled three and below for everything. Well, I'm actually AP minus one, one damage, so. 
Oh, you're only AP minus one? Yeah, wow, that stinks. Well, the cover cancels one of them, so I save one. Two? Oh, two, but I still have uh, five. That I believe that is at least damage three. Yes. <laughs> so there's the squad. Blast Cannon! Hits! Does not wound. If I can see you, you can see me. With that note, this Chimera, multi-laser, heavy stubber, and heavy bolter into them. Minus one to hit them because of stealth. Hit multi-laser. Oof, all nope. fails. Yep. Uh, heavy bolter. One hit, oh my goodness. <gasps> Nothing, and heavy stub. 50 kill actually hits. 50 kill does not wound. God bless it. Emperor bless it. Well, same thing, really. My goodness, I love Chimeras. Because Chimera number three, same weapons, including Laws Gun Array, into those SOBs. Multi laser! Wow, two oh, hits. Uh, wait, was it stationary? It moved. Okay. I did try. You did. Um, no wounds. Heavy bolter. One hit. Wow. One wound. AP, doesn't matter. Two damage. So that is one dead. Come on, Laws Guns, do your thing. Oh, no, one hit. That's better than nothing. One wound. Yes. One takes a wound. All right, so Brett has named uh, the one that took the wound as Captain Squiggly Butt. Speaking of misfiring, Canadians who have to stay in place into them with a crack grenade. Because why not? Wait. Oh, yeah, because you're shooting out with a grenade launcher. Oof. Okay. Five to hit. Oh, dang. Uh, lethal hit ability means... Automatically wound on an unmodified six to hit. Oh, well, in that case... You need at least a... Dang it. Whoa. Yes, that one wooden guy is dead. Squiggle butts. So, crack grenade. Misses. Completely. But you still do have a sentinel. Yes, and it's going to shoot into the... This guy right here. The Thunderstrike? Yes. Motor laser. Wow, almost all hits. Almost. And no toughness. Nine. So five's re-rolling any... Never you were mind. saying something? Yeah, so that many at no AP. Three ups. Whee! All made. Ah, dang. Well, it was the end of my turn, and just a quick little recap. I'm very surprised of, well, how much I actually killed. So, sadly, I got no objectives. Well, I got no points for objectives because, well... Not turn two yet. Yeah. So, other than that, Mason, you actually failed a Battlefly test for the Eliminators. Yep. So I cannot use stratagems on them. They cannot score objectives this turn. Oh, wow. Yeah, I know, right? Well, will the Deathwatch Raven Guard, I don't know who the heck these guys are. This, the Alpha, the... Um, Alpha Legion. Alpha Legion, same Clearly, as that. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, and uh, I'm going to declare uh, fear tactics. Okay. From it, Death Watch, basically, it's kind of like a doctrine. You declare it once per game. In this case, it becomes sustained hits one for everything. It's playful. Mm -hmm. yeah, everything just did a little bit of shuffling. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Sh stayed stationary. Shuffled, shuffled. I cannot use any st CP with them because they failed their Battleshock test, even though the captain is in there. It's a you tactical withdrawal, okay, guys? You would think the captain would have better leadership than everybody, anybody else. You know? Mason, I'm just going to say one quick thing. But no. You were in the army. How good was the officers that you dealt with? Depended on the officers. Overall? Eh, pretty alright. Oh, well, in that case, never mind. other units, though. Anywho, so let's talk about what is the first thing that's going to be shooting. Uh, first off, I'm going to shoot these two incursors mm -hmm. at the Oath of Moment... Uh, what's he called again? Demolisher. Demolisher. So that if they get a hit, everything gets a plus one to hit against him. Well, the funny thing is I'm going to do is to, like, screw you over. Smoke. Oh, yeah. 
and cursors. You said you're popping smoke using mm -hmm. your CP, so they need uh, fours to hit. One does hit, which means everything will get plus one to hit you, countering your minus one. Does it wound though? I need a six. Nope. So close though. Uh, that's not the important part though. All right, so the last eliminator and the captain with the special bolter are shooting at him because they both have precision and the eliminator himself will have devastating wounds because they are stationary and plus one to hit because heavy weapon is stationary. So first off, two to hit, sixes are exploding. Oh wow. Two hits. Now sixes turn its three damage weapon into a mortal wounds, but I only, it's strength five mm -hmm. against toughness. Four. So these are each AP minus a lot. Do you have a save against AP minus two? I'm um, sorry, yeah, minus two. Well, because I'm a three up eight, I'm in cover, so... But it only... So I would have a, if my math is right, four up save. I uh, see, because you go down two. Yep, you have make two four ups, because these are each three damage. Wow, so close. And what's his wounds? Three. So he dead. All right, Storm Speeder Thunderstrike is shooting at the Demolisher. It will get a plus one to hit, negating your minus one, which means it'll be hitting you on twos with most of its weapons. How are you hitting on a two? Native. It's already normally hitting on twos. Mm -hmm. It's There's plus one from the, uh, oh. from the cursors and minus one from your smoke, so I'm back at twos. Oh, wow. Okay, in that case. First off is a Storm Fury missile. It uh. hits, exploding because of sustained hits from the Death Watch. Mm -hmm. Strength 12, so threes. Mm -hmm. Rerolling because. Off a moment. AP minus three. So we'll have fives. Oof. Damage. D6 plus one. Okay. So that is three and four. So that'll be uh, seven. Two. Yeah, seven so far. That's just from the first weapon. Oh, delightful. What else is next? Next is the Thunderstrike Laz Talon. Two shots. Both hit. Yep, both hit. And strength nine. But oh, the moment? Yes. Nothing. Nothing? No. And then I still have 24 inches for the Twin Icarus Rocket Pod. <laughs> That's if you hit it all. Yep. Uh, D3 shots, though. So two shots. Hitting on th threes now. But oh, a moment. So... Uh, that would be a failure, but exploding sixes because of the sustained hits granted from Fury Tactics. Strength eight, though. And re-rolling this because of Oath of Moment. Strength one again? Strength eight. Okay, so two wounds. AP is minus one. So threes. Oof, damage. Dose. Gotcha. And that, is that it for that guy? Uh, yes, for that guy. Get your suit trying to shoot up the damaged, highly damaged, uh, Demolisher. I'm trying to save the last Thunder Strike for another target. I'm trying. But we'll see how this goes. First off, the Heavy Bolter, because why not? Might just want to hit, remember that? Yep. Well then, Oath of Moment. Alright, so that Exploder will make this one hit. Mm -hmm. And that, so that's all hits. Now, strength five, so I need sixes to wound, but re-rolling thanks to... But did they get a plus one wound? No, that was from the, something else. That was Thunderstrike, then I forgot about it when I really needed it. So just one AP minus one so far. Oh, I made it. Okay. Now for the uh, Twin Iron Hail. Uh, because your smoke... Oh wait, it, I also have plus one to hit on you, so they all do hit. Mm-hmm. And re-rolling because of Oath Moments, Strength, and it's also Twin Linked. I still need fives, though. So just one so far. AP? Minus one, two, uh, three damage. I'm good. All right. And then the anti-personnel shooters. One is an Exploder, 
and let's see. Nope. So one explodes, so I'm going to add that back to the pool. But I need sixes here. No, but Oath of Moment and Twin Linked. Nope, nothing from that. All right, second Thunder Strike into the Demolisher. Oh, yay. I might survive. Storm Fury hits. Strength 12. Uh, it's it does a have, and it does have plus one yep. wound. I forgot about that last one. So AP is minus three. So five up save. Ooh, so close. Damage. D6 plus one. Okay. So two. Let's go to the last towns. Hitting on twos. Mm -hmm. And strength nine. This is two AP minus threes. Oh, damage. D6 plus one again. Okay. You saw how that went last time. So I need a two higher. Oh my goodness. <sighs> one wound left. Okay, Twin Icarus, you got this. Hits? Um, no, because it hits on threes. And plus one and minus one counteract each other. But for moment. the moment. It got worse, of course. Anyway, tried it. Now it's time to go to the last Invector Warsuit against him. This is why we have the rules on hand, because it actually has 13 moons, not 14 moons. I don't know why the heck... I was thinking it was 14, but either way, Mason, congratulations, you destroyed it. Still, two ones in a row for damage on D6 plus one when I have a reroll. It's all one still. <laughs> all right, in Victor Warsuit, since that Demolisher is now dead, is going to shoot at the Scout Sentinel, which apparently now has a two-up armor save. Uh, it's an armor sentinel, not a Scout Sentinel. Big difference. Scott Sentinels used to be a four up armor save, and these armored used to be a three up. So it got better by one point. A lot, which it matters a lot. Anyway, uh, Heavy Bolter first. Let's see, it has sustained hits natively and through the uh, Fear Tactics, however, they do not stack. So I'm going to add one die to there. And Strength 5. So one wound. One AP minus one. Two oh, damage. okay then. What else do you have? Uh, next up is the twin iron hail auto cannon. Three shots. Exploder from the Fear Tactics. So I'm just going to keep that in the pool. Strength nine, and it is twin linked. So all wounds, AP minus one. So three up saves. So one fail damage. Three. Uh, Oakley to Oakley. So that is five damage in total. Mm -hmm. And Twin Iron Hail Heavy Stubber. All so links. With an Exploder. Mm -hmm. However, this is Twin Linked with Strength 4. Oh, wow. Uh, twin Linked, because I don't think Strength 4 wounds you. Nope. So three. Okay, AP zeros. One damage each. I'm actually all good, thank goodness. Considering what the target was, yes, however, I know you're about to destroy something very important. Hopefully. Actually, you know what? Um, I might do something just for giggles. You want to charge me? Yeah, I think I'll just charge you just for giggles. Okay. So, charge range. You're in. All right, I'm doing this charge just because I want to see how things go. Close combat, four, sh four attacks, hitting on threes. W one miss. Yep, and strength four, so I'm probably gonna need sixes. So nothing there. Then my attacks back, I got three of them hitting on fours. Does your Chimera have bayonets? I would play did actually. <laughs> and strength six, so I'm guessing... T9. So fives. Strength six. Oh, wow. Two wounds. My movement was actually quite somewhat eventful. Disembark, move up. Yep, from there. The Chimera actually... Fell back like a coward. Tactical withdrawal, but the guards... Coward. But the guardsmen inside did um, get out before. First. Yep. Um, Sentinel moved up, and the Chimera just swung around the wall. So he's going to be charging next, right? Yeah. Okay, good, good, good. And on that note, we are going to start with 
This one over here is going to shoot everything that he takes in place at him. Melt a gun! Ooh. Nope. You no, got I'm... other stuff to shoot. Don't worry about it. Crack grenade! Nope. Wow. Um, yeah. Laws guns. And. Wow, no. Jeez, no sixes. That's. I'm actually very sad about that. That's, but you should have gotten like about four there. Canyons, melt a gun into them, everything else, including crack grenade, into them. Yay! Melt a time! Wow, okay, how about the crack grenade from the grenade launcher? Okay, never mind. Lost guns! There are some sixes there. But that doesn't matter because they got out of a vehicle and that counts as moving. Oh, that's right, so they don't get... Is it lethal hits? Correct. It would have been lethal hits, okay. Yes. Uh, five to wound. Look at that many... That's not that bad. I'll t I'm going to save one of these for now. I'm just going to roll five at a time here. Uh, because the captain only has five wounds, not six. So, so far I'm going to take dose, so I can roll this. So the captain is going to take two wounds. So now April's going to shoot its Bama Cannon and Lyle's Cannon into the... Wounded. Thunderstrike. Thunderstrike, there we go. Then the Heavy Bolfers and Heavy Summer into the Eliminator. Boop, boop, boop. Is it minus one hit? Yes. So fives, re-rolling all misses. Oh, wow, okay. Because you are on an objective. Yes. And these do have the lethal hit ability. Because he was still. Right, so one automatic wound, AP minus one. AP minus one, I am in terrain. So that cancels it out. So three up, huzzah. El Capitan will take another. Two damage. Now this is going to the Thunderstrike wounded. Yes, battle cannon, Gex. Six fox, oh, that's not that bad, I guess. Wow, so three lethal hex, I like that. And three regular hex. Uh, one of you on threes. So five and eight minus one. Lulls, fours, So that is three damage each. So that is nine. So, wow, it's got an L. Reroll that hit. It hicks. It wounds. AP is, I believe, minus three. Yes. So I need a six. I do not make a six. It is D6 plus one. I only have two anyway. So the question is, does it explode? It does not. Oh, thank you. So the white green chimera shooting everything into the eliminators. I'm probably just going to let the captain die first. So multi ladies will start off. Hitting on fives. No lethal. And wow, okay. Two damn, I mean, two wounds. No AP. He's dead, thank goodness. Heavy Bolter. Hopefully, I can finish up that last eliminator. No hicks. Heavy Stubber. No hicks. What, what about that last kind of raid? Oh, wow. One, two, three hits at least? Yeah, and I can fives. One wound. Nothing. So, Brett was going to shoot this Sentinel into the Incursors, but I reminded him of the close support feature of the Invictor, and he went, nope, nope, never mind. So, one laser into the last Eliminator. Hopefully I can actually kill him. Any fives? Oh, shit. A lot of fives. Galaxy. All, all of them. Oh, three wounds. Beep. AP, doesn't matter. Yeah. I have threes. One is cocked. Oh, so close. So. One damage. Yep. So, this squad. Into the last eliminator. Crack grenade for the grenade launcher. So, everyone's going to be shooting at him except for a pistol and a melt gun that do not have range. Grenade launcher, go! Grenade launcher, fail! Now you should have seven. Yep. Laws guns. All misses. Wow, he's fired from the hip, I guess. I mean, they're running. So, makes sense. Anyway, I believe that was your turn too. And I got three command points. I mean, victory points. Um, 
Alright, so... But before we go on, I want to say I'm very confused of why a sweet buttery goodness's name is everything moving forward. Uh, because I just feel like destroying things and I have Oath a Moment on him. So and? <laughs> I still got two points from being here and here at the start of my command phase. Yes. But I need have Oath a Moment and I have a lot of weapons that need to destroy him because he is my main threat. If I can eliminate him at that point, everything else is very... It will have a tough time destroying me. Yeah, they were right. Yes, you're right about that, but things can change. And Camera of Shame. Uh, CP I was thinking about is only on the Space Marine Strad, regular Space Marine Codex, not the Kill Team. I was thinking not about, I was thinking about Transhuman Physiology, not Armor of Contempt. Armor of Contempt is actually better, and it improves, worsens AP, incoming AP by one. I was thinking Transhuman Physiology, that is my F up. Uh, however, I, we, looked at and we don't really think the dice no and anyway. no no so in essence bad mason bad bad mason and it didn't really affect anything anyway and uh, because and because we fucked up one of the units have to die yep also this one right here it has to die automatically also we did <laughs> grant uh this movement a little this unit a little bit of movement because i messed up with the tape measure and bumped things so being nice we moved things up and However, even though that would put me within rapid fire range of him, I'm not going to accept that rapid fire range so that I can give him all the benefits without any of the costs for me accidentally dropping a tape measure. Thank you. And to about shooting, where are they going to start your shooting at, Mason? Uh, well, first off, I'm going to shoot those two incursors at him. Oh, okay. All right, two incursors shooting at the Sentinel. Lols. <laughs> Come on, Mason, use a command point. You can do it. No. Uh, see, next up, I'm going to shoot the Eliminator at that same target, just for giggles. Let's see if he does anything. He does. Now, strength five against toughness, I assume, like nine. Something like that, yeah. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think I'm wounding you on a two. No, no, no. no. no, no. Mm -hmm. So, next up, um... I will go downstairs and kill a gallon of milk. That too. I'm going to shoot a lot of things, all the vehicles, at April. You know what I'm going to do already? Smoke. Yes. Okay. And the shooting force with what? Uh, Thunderstrike, just to get the good shit out of the way. Oh, could I what weapon is this? This is the big old missile that is strength 12. So first up, boop. I'm going to need now threes to hit you because of your minus one shenanigans. And strength 12, plus one to wound. Fails. Oath of moment anyway. There we go. AP. Is minus three. Okay. Um, um, two up armor in cover, so it's like having AP minus two. So in that case, uh... Four up. Yay, math. Boo. Uh, D6 plus one. Four points so far. Okay. And then I have two Thunderstrike Laz Talons. But both of moment. Lulls, same thing. So then the Twin Icarus Rocket Pod. Actually, let me check the range on that. D3 shots. One shot. Hits. Or no, not anymore because of both of both of them will let me reroll because you have smoke. And because I need four now. Nope. Uh, so I think I just lost the game. But. but God damn, <laughs> I lost the game now. <laughs> oh. Now, in Victor Warsuit, that is way to the side here. Mm hmm. Shooting everything that he can at April. Do you have rain for everything? Already measured, yes. Well, I'm within 36 inches. Okay. And this is? This is going to be the Twin Linked Iron Hail Auto Cannon. Okay. Jeez. Oh, for a moment. Yes. <laughs> oh, Alex. All right, all right. All right. All right. Uh, strength nine. Oh, for a moment. One wound. AP minus one. Wall. So two. I'm good. All right. Heavy bolter. Ooh. And. Oh, well. 
No, like it's minus one. Yes, yeah, so that will fail. So with a moment that. Okay. And. With a moment. Mm, nope, nope, I don't think that no. does anything. Toughness 11. And then the anti personnel twin, uh, twin iron hail heavy stubber. With a moment. Wait, no, fours do hit. Yeah. And then it is twin linked with Oath of Moments, because I need sixes to wound you. Oh, one six. AP zero. It does uh, something! Of course. All right, last in Victor Warsuit with 36 inch range is going into April. Good luck! Let's go shoot first. Uh, the twin iron hail auto cannon. All misses, but Oath of Moment. moment. One hit. AP? Minus one. Three damage. Oh, I'm good. Heavy bolter? Not with a moment. I'm detecting a pattern here. Yes. Sixes. Oh, wow. Okay. Minus one. I'm good. Because that would have been fine to go through if you weren't in cover. Now, the anti-personnel heavy, twin iron hail heavy stubber. Not with a moment. And six is to wound you. Oh, the moment. Oh, one. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> of course, it's the one damage weapon, not the three damage. All right, so a 10 inch charge from, with the Invictor Warsuit against the Guardsman, because why not try it out? Amazing, just roll the damn dice. All right, I'll come to you. <laughs> okay. Finally, something that isn't a travesty. You know what I'm going to do? Um, how many command points do I have? I only have one. So. Because you did use smoke, yes. Yeah, so... Okay. Just for giggles again, he's going to charge this and see how this goes. Okay. Somehow I think that's it. So, Alright, and Victor with his five big punches. Any on... Threes. Wow. Strength 14. Barely. AP is minus 2. I can do this with a 7 up. 7 up? Can he take 3 damage? Yes. Alright, Thunderstrike against your Chimera. 2 hits. No wounds. Uh, what's the strength? 4. <laughs> oh, wow. How's my Chimera actually stronger than your... Thunder Strike. Uh, Thunder Strike. My, it's my Chimera into your Thunder Strike. Three Hex. Wow, that's. Uh, five to wound. No wounds. So, with the Thunder Strike, basically the guys inside are punching you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and now for the Gargsman over there. Gargsman, poke him with the bayonet! Oh, wow. Okay, that's not that bad, actually. Uh, I need sixes, though. To wound? Yes. Oh, look at that, I got one six. Oh, look, I got a three X save. So, for now, he'll survive. You'll have to fold him back, but I have a sneaking suspicion they're going to fall forward or sideways. Maybe. So, it is now very desperate medical for the Guardsmen. Starting over here, the Guardsmen did a tactical withdrawal. Set them moved up. Tactical withdrawal with the Chimera. Move the Fog Troopers up. Thank God I have sticky objectives. And the Chimera um, sped up a little bit. So starting off with shooting. Let's go with this actually. Let's do one command point. I'm going to do grenades from the Fog Troops into them. Also, because the way that we read the rules. The strategy, yes. Yes. I'm going to shoot. I can shoot, my, shoot normally. So I'm going to shoot my Laws guns into the Eliminator. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to shoot the Melter gun and the Grenade Launcher crack into him. So starting off, starting off with the grenades. Okay, I need four up. Okay, so four mortal wounds on the Landspeeder. 
Thumb strike. Melt a gun. Yes. Of course. Uh, now this is going to be the grenade launcher, a crack one. Wow, okay. Okay, wow, guns. Hitting on fives. Five, because this is against the eliminator. But I did get two sixes, so lethal hits. And fives to wound. So now he's two to wound. It's me rolling. Oh, wow. So hopefully my sitting order is going to destroy that eliminator. Water laser. Wow. Mm -hmm. One hit. One wound. Oh, dang it. Limerus tank commander. Barrel cannon. Lyle's cannon. And two. The thunder strike. Heavy bolt rolls and heavy sub into the orb suit. Battle cannon time. I get one, seven. That's not that. That's still higher. You've been rolling higher than average for that thing. Yes. Um, Reroll all failed hicks, which is, geez, all of them, except one. This does not have stealth, I hope you remember. I know, but I do have one instant wound. And... No, it's really metal, Toughness so. 9. It does not have stealth. <laughs> AP minus 1. AP minus 1, so 4 ups. Whee! 2 failures. So that is 6 points of damage. And now the. Wild Cannon! Hits! It's an automatic wound, so AP minus 3. 6 up. Boop! Oh my sweet god, okay. Heavy Bolters! Angry! Oh wow, so angry that I actually got a. Oh, sustained hit also, because I forgot about heavy bolters. So Staying in place. Yes. And and sustained hits yes. natively from heavy bolters. And he fives. So you have three and minus one. Three minus one, so fours. Huzzah! Okay, um, how about that heavy sober? It's possible. Uh, na -na -na, all hicks. Na -na 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 Batman. Nothing. Because the top is like that. Oh, yes. All right, so this squad, I assume everything into the one wound Thunderstrike? Yes. You can hear my annoyance in my voice. Delta gun, by the way. Oh, it hits. It's a sustained hit. So, AP minus four. All right, uh, it's AP minus four, so I don't get a save. Does it go boom? That is the opposite of what I wanted. Aha! <laughs> 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 one six. One six. And so we're just going to call the game there. Yes, because, well, Mason, do you want to flick my hand? I yep. Just, okay. Well, air shake because you were just in the... <laughs> hey, I yeah. do wash my hands. I'm not French, okay? <laughs> Wait, do the French... They do wash... Anyway, you don't want to get fucked, what? What was that? Anyway, um, so we are decided to call the game because Mason... <laughs> so the only thing... Now, my gamble, which didn't pay off in this turn was to destroy April. April's the only threat on the board, but I no longer have the firepower that can really deal with her, even with these two invectors. Even if I call the uh, lethal hits ability, the once per game that Deathwatch get, yes, I got a lot of shots, because it's basically nine plus possible of D3 uh, extra, but with a two up armor save, even with Oath of Moment re-rolling hits and wounds, it's... Plus smoke on top of that. Yeah, plus smoke. I'm just not going to get seven damage through with the two Invictor Warsuits. Well, the if also... I had been able to destroy it on the last turn, then I would be able to bully the center and, my, and keep my back two objectives without too much of an issue. Well, and so... I would have been able to get uh, back ahead on points. So, what my plan was to actually, I had a feeling that next turn, this, because what, I still had two commanders left to shoot. I was going to plan to shoot this one and him, and the light green commando was going to go and light up either the yep. last eliminator or the guys in the bottom. Like, the chimeras, I am not worried about. It's right now, I, ha you have firepower to affect me. I do not have firepower enough to destroy the threat to me and take over the objectives. Yeah, on top of that, then we have one unit, two, three, four units. I have four units, with which for Space Marines is not that bad. 
No, it is not. But because they are durable, like I said, your uh, Laz guns and your uh, Laz uh, multi lasers, I'm not worried about. It's April is going to realistically kill or and Invictor a turn. Yes. Realistically, even if I were to um, uh, bracket April, it's still. I'm in a losing battle because I took that gamble. I took myself off of objectives to maximum fire maximize firepower. I took that gamble, and I lost. Simple as that. I did forget to... I should have called the lethal hits uh, on my turn, two, But one, I forgot. And two, I don't think it would have really mattered anyway. Not that much, anyway. So, just with how I rolled... I said, I took the gamble, I lost, I was hoping to destroy April, and then just endure. Because realistically, would Guardsmen, Chimeras, and a Sentinel that is wounded, realistically be able to kill two Invictors, an Eliminator that apparently survives everything, <laughs> <laughs> and the two Incursors in the back, which I could just fall back. And all of a sudden, you really can't shoot them because of the obscuring terrain. Yeah. Well, still, it was a good game. Mason, yet again, it was excellent. Mm -hmm. So, uh, air shake because your hands are not as clean as we would like. <laughs> well, I mean, I was just in the bathroom. I do wash my hands. But that doesn't matter because, guys, get your fit painted.